Hey, what's up? You know, it's been a while since I played Druid. You know what looks fun? The car Druid. That looks like a lot of fun. But I heard only the biggest IQ can play such a deck. Ha! <laughs> this guy's toast. I didn't go to the gym today because my legs are sore. I'm thinking about going five times a week. Like two days, one day break. 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 I feel weak. Priest. Okay. This is an uh, interesting hand. Do I don't even want to play Biology Project early on. What do I mulligan for? Sounds like I need card draw the most. Acolyte, auctioneer, etc., etc. Oh lord, this is not what you would call a good hand. Oh lord, this is a good hand. Does they trying to gain weight or get toned? What I'm trying to achieve out of exercising is having better mental health. Because I'm satisfied with my body. Like, I don't have the hottest body. But I'm satisfied with it, you know? I don't need to be ripped. I don't need to be skinny. I don't need to put on muscle. But mentally, I'm in a bad mental place these days. Because I feel like I'm not achieving much with my life. So that's how. Exercising helped me. Also forces me to wake up at 9 a.m., which is like a reasonable human being time. This will be good. I wonder what kind of deck he is. He's not doing much. Since I have two auction here, I can just throw one away. He's drawing a lot. He could be clone priest. Two druids. I mean, one druid, one priest. Five passes in a row. Coin, uh, shadow essence. I'm assuming a coin priest. Yeah, there you go. Ooh, mama, that needs to die like yesterday. Here's the other weird thing, right? I'm supposed to be saving naturalizers. Hmm. If I moonfire then top deck pounds, I can still kill it. If not, I have to naturalize it, which I really don't want to do. Actually, I can also top deck Jasper Spellstone, I suppose. Well, there goes my options. I gotta naturalize this. I Man, I could leave it alive, but I don't think that is the goodest of ideas. Maybe I can mill something really useful. Nope. Oh, it's not too bad. Yeah, I've never played her card Druid, so it's going to take me a while to understand the subtle nuances. Oh, does he have Smite for my 4-4? Four four? He has exactly a second Smite to kill my 4-4. Four four. Wait, if I use second natural... Oh my god, this hand! How do I beat him now? This is really not. This is not cash money at all. <sighs> this is not cash money. I think we're. I mean, I could naturalize it. I just feel like we're going to lose the game if we do that. Okay, um, I have an idea, Chad. Look, it's not the, it's not a good idea, let's be honest, but it's an idea. It is an idea. Yeah, that's fine. Am I afraid to give him mana? Yeah, a little bit.
How have I not hit a spell stone yet? That's what. That's my question. You know, we all have questions, don't we, chat? My question is, how did I not hit a spell stone yet? That's the one. Just so if he trades off, he'll die. I'm a little worried. He's got two radiant elemental on the board. All right, that's fine. I need you, I need to hope I don't draw my acolyte of pain here. That would be really unfortunate. All right, chat. Let us all pray for no acolyte of pain. Does that rhyme? No, it doesn't. So if we do this, right, chat? Listen, listen. If we do this, and then we do this. And then we do this. Am I, not, am I gonna fatigue myself? And then, chat, listen, mate, listen. And then I do this. Ah, uh, I mean. Things are happening. Am I winning or losing? It's so hard to tell you. Yeah, whatever. My hand it's not like I wanted that card anyway. <sighs> Wait, I can open summon something out again. Well, Pyro, sure. Do I draw or armor? Or do I armor and then draw? Or do I not draw at all? It is an OTK priest. Maybe one draw, one armor. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. My head hurts. He's got 10 cards, but I'm still alive. Well, if he pops off this turn, I mean, what can you really pop off with, I guess? Sure, you'll get a Velen, but what you're gonna do with one measly old Velen? Wait, Velen is good. Velen doubles the damage off Hakar's blood. Velen helps us? If we double up on the damage, I mean, this is really scary, right? I can't draw too much before I swap. Oh, this is going to be a very weird game. Where did your naturalize go? I have to spend it on the villain, unfortunately. Dude, his one of her cards gonna put so much damage on him. He doesn't have. He only has two Mind Blasts at most, so that's 40 damage. If he has three Mind Blasts, I'm dead. If he reses another Velen, that's 40 damage off one Mind Blast. He needs three combo piece. Two combo piece won't do it here. He needs three. I hope I draw my Corrupted Blood here. If I draw Ferocious Howl, it'll be really freaking bad. I need to draw my corrupted blood. It's a 50-50, right? I'm running out of cards. The reason why corrupted blood is good here. So now there's two corrupted blood in my hand, right? If I play this, I go to seven mana, and then I play this, I go to six mana. Let the pain speak to me. 
I go to eight mana here, right? And I moonfire my own acolyte. Which would put four corrupted blood in my deck. And here's the thing. Corrupted blood gets buffed by Malagos and it gets buffed by Velen. So it's 12 damage per corrupted blood and there's four of them. So this should be 48 damage then. He just killed himself by super buffing the damage he takes from corrupted blood, right? 16. 16. Sorry, my math is off. 16. 16. He thought it was his win condition, but it was actually his lose condition. Lights out.